Timmy has been an important part of the forest saga. He was our son, we lost him, we found him, and we brought him back to life, and now he's on Sons of the Forest Island. And he's also trying to kill us. A little confused? I'm here to explain. We interact three times with Timmy in Sons of the Forest. The big bad sluggy cutscene in the residential bunker, when we open the doors to the beep bunker, and at the ending of the game. That's it. But there is so much more that we don't know about Timmy. We can spawn him in Sons of the Forest by cheats, typing add character Timmy1. And he will appear in all his glory. And this is not just a T-Post NPC, he has several animations such as a drink some barbon, wash himself in the river and shoot at everything that fucking moves. You too. Yes, Timmy will shoot at us, no matter if you're playing nice and peacefully, he will fucking hunt you down. And this is the big thing. Since fans discovered Timmy was going to be featured in the next update, maybe in patch 5, everyone has been wondering if it was a sort of reward to have chosen to remain on the island. It was a very good theory though, I believed it till a few days ago when I found out Timmy shoots at you anytime he can. And here is why I started wondering if Timmy will be an only or an enemy. We know Timmy came to the island before our crash and so is father protagonist of the forest. What if, once we crash, we can randomly encounter him on the island while he's seeking for the bunkers and he shoots at us thinking we're on the bad side? This will be dope. Imagine not only fear cannibals and mutants, but also a man that will hunt you down, not with a knife or a bone, but using a gun and no fear to shoot. This will be interesting and very, very entertaining. A complete new formula compared to the forest. Also, this would explain the lack of cannibals armed with ranged weapons. Also, the addition of team into the game would mean more story elements, and this could be set in the golf camp's bunker. Since it is useless and there is a dead end all the way, it could be the perfect place to set new story elements. And the next thing would be a chasing and play where we're coming after Timmy, or Timmy hunting us in the bunker. Oh god, that will be awesome. And lastly, philosophy time. The fact that Timmy could be in the game since the beginning of our journey is not excluding that he will stay on the island as an only if we choose to stay. So, his AI system will change completely and from a deadly enemy he will become an only cannibal and mutant killer. Now, how will Timmy act before and after the ending? In the first part, he could be just like a normal player, so we could find some already built stuff like a temporary shelter and a fire, with him resting or exploring the forest. Eventually, he will come to us uh, and shoot like we're cannibals and then run away, or maybe we run away, and he won't stop shooting, forcing us to evade him in a way or another. And maybe he will work just like Virginia does, so we can get his trust and we can already have him as an all in the first phase. This will also explain why Tim is so nice when we open the bunker's doors. In the second phase, he will be an only and work just like all the other friendly NPCs. So guys, that's my personal theory about Timmy, I think he will be added maybe in the next update for Sons of the Forest that will be released in around 3 weeks, so let me know in the comments what do you think about this, what are your theories about Timmy, if you enjoyed this video leave a like and consider subscribing, follow me on all the social media, especially in our reddit community and discord server on Instagram and Facebook, and always remember to survive the forest.